solve the following equations. The cube root of 4x minus 5 is equal to 4. When we move on up to higher roots, we can use the same ideas, except instead of squaring both sides of an equation, we'll have to raise each side of the equation to the same index that's in the root. So here we have the cube root of 4x minus 5 is equal to 4. We will raise each side of the equation to the third power, yielding 4x minus 5 is equal to 64. And then we'll solve for x by adding 5. So 4x is equal to 69. And dividing by 4, so x is equal to 69 over 4, or 17.25. Good idea to check your work. So math, let's put in math in the cube root. Oops. Cube root of 4 times 6, uh, 4 times 17.5. 17.25 minus 5. And close off the cube root, and it does give us 4, so that's a good solution. Exercise B, negative 2 times the fifth root of 3x plus 8 is equal to 6. Let's isolate the radical first. I'll divide through by the negative 2. So then the fifth root of 3x plus 8 is equal to negative 3. Raising both sides to the fifth power. All right, negative 3, raise that to the fifth power, is negative 243. So 3x plus 8 is equal to negative 243. Subtracting 8. 3x is negative 251, and dividing by 3, x is negative 251 thirds. And again, you could check your solution with this using a similar procedure as in exercise A.